It's National Park Week, and we are celebrating by taking you to a gem in the Arlington area, and it is the Arbitorium in Jacksonville. In this edition of In Your Backyard. <laughs> A lot of people consider uh, the Arboretum the jewel of Arlington. It's only five miles from downtown and it provides so much nature. In the middle of Jacksonville, we have 13 different ecosystems. We have tons of different plants and animals that you can see, and some that are extremely rare, like the Florida rosemary. Um, we have, you know, protected gopher tortoises, foxes, river otters, crawfish, largemouth bass. Uh, just tons and tons of animals. So to be able to see that that wide variety again of habitat and uh, flora and fauna so close to a city is, is really um, special. And we have 3.5 miles of trails, seven trails total. So people really come out and, and can get some good hiking in um, in the middle of flat Jacksonville. The Arboretum property is actually really interesting. People came out here and hiked, but also a lot of people came out and used it as an illegal dump. And so it really fell into um, a state of disrepair. Um, it was used a couple times um, for borrow, borrow pits, which is sort of a misnomer. They don't ever put the, the dirt back. So the lake is a result of that, and our ravines um, on the far side of the lake are the result of that as well. Um, and so finally, um, in 2004, a group of uh, local citizens got together and they wanted to really clean up the property and get rid of the stuff that had been dumped here. And so um, they started a nonprofit organization. They started their lease with the city in 2006, and um, they we opened uh, as a Jackson, the Jacksonville Arboretum and Gardens property in 2008. And so um, since that time, we've been adding trails and bridges and benches and improvements. And all of the structures that you see are volunteer made. So we get a lot of help from um, community organizations and Boys and Girl Scouts and things like that. We have a lot of activities um, that are uh, available for a wide ranges of uh, age groups and abilities. Um, not only can you walk and run the trails, um, we have posts um, with QR codes on them. So if you have a QR scanner on your phone, you can hold your phone up to these posts. And um, the ones that have lotus flowers on them will show you a yoga position that you can do there. The ones with owls on them will tell you a bit about the natural um, scenery that you're looking at at that post. We have a lot of people that come out and do birding. Um, we have free programs. The second Saturday of every month at 9.30, we have a free guided nature tour. Um, some of those have themes, such as um, people and plants, which is uh, our current theme for all of our plantings. All current plantings, the plant needs to have a, a use by human beings. On Saturdays, we also have work days, so volunteers come out and help pull weeds or um, remove invasive plants or trim trees, whatever we need at that time. Um, and those are from 9 to noon on Saturday. It's a great way for people to get out in nature and do a little gardening and give back or um, add up some uh, volunteer hours if they need them. Besides being a great place to walk and hike, the Arboretum provides many volunteering opportunities as well as year-round community events. For more information, you can go to the website, which is jacksonvillearboretum.org.